Hi guys, my name is Kendo Luayemi and welcome to my vlog. So this vlog is kind of weird, but hey, I'm just gonna be myself and just do whatever I want. But you know, whatever we do in life, we gotta create a specific and authentic lifestyle for ourselves. It's very important. And the reason why it's important is because it helps you live a, a kind of different life from 90% of people. If you don't have a specific lifestyle for yourself, you just be living the same life like 90% of people. And that's what differentiates 1%, 5%, 10% people from 90% of people. Because they have a different kind of life that they want to live compared to the majority of the people that they know. And that's what makes them become wealthy, rich, healthy, and you know, are respected in certain places that they go to. And that applies to anybody, myself. If you want to live a different part of life that's very unique to your own taste, you have to create certain steps for yourself. You have to walk in a different line from what majority of the people you've always known are walking into. You have to just do things differently and you have to dream big. You have to have a uh, passion for what you do. And that's one important thing. Not everybody has passion for what they do. People do things for many reasons, but I'll tell you one single truth. Most of the people that do things just now, listen to me on that part, just for money, regret that decision in the long run. I have yet to sit with a lot of people uh, from different background, different ethnicity. And some of them that have done things just for money, regretted it because I get to listen to a lot of stories from male, female, um, white, black, you name it. I've listened to different stories. And one thing I have learned from those stories is that you have to do things for purpose, not just for money. You can take this or not. If you do things just for money, you will regret it. After you um, acquire the money, you get tired of it and become bored. And you will want the life of purpose again. And it might be too late. And that's why when you're doing things, do things for purpose. Have dignity. Dignity is very important. And mostly for men and for women, but mostly for men, it's very important. If you have dignity, have something that you stand by. If you stand for nothing, then you're nothing. It's very simple. Look at most people that stand for nothing. Their family are not confident in them because they stand for nothing. At the end of the day, they become shameful of their own behaviors. So have the guts to stand for something as a man because you're leader to your spouse, your girlfriend, your kids. You should be an hero to them. But in order for you to be a hero, you gotta have the balls to stand for something. So guys, um, it's a very chill vlogging today. Nothing much going on. We have been interviewing a couple of people. It's been going great. And there's something I discovered from that as well. Sometimes people say they want something, but the question is, do they really want that thing? And I've always come across these things a lot. I've been thinking about it. Why do people say they want this stuff, but their action towards that thing is not really giving the vibe that they want that thing? Why am I saying this? So my company has been hiring a couple of people for brand strategist position, which I said in my previous vlogging or my previous vlog. And Let's say we got about almost 15 resumes and we sent out interview day to majority of them, literally. And only 50% of them responded. Now that got me thinking that, why did you apply for a job if you're not prepared to check your email constantly to get a feedback on the job you applied for? Then later on, you're worried about not getting a job. It's the thing that we got to repair in our brain and the way we do things. Do you know how many people are looking for jobs? In this 
world or in, in my let's talk about where i stay in dallas texas there are more than millions of people looking for job now what tells you that you're going to be picked among the millions of people looking for job when you're not as consistent and effective like about 800 people looking for job or 800,000 people looking for job so it's very important when you go for something prioritize yourself and be consistent ready to follow up you should be on top of your game and that's one way you can make it in life nothing waits for nobody people don't wait for you they keep moving they see the passion and the effectiveness how you want something they see the hunger and they give you that thing and that's one thing i think many people are lacking if you want something you go for it you show passion you show emotion you show physical strength you show that this thing matters to you because at the end of the day you're going to get paid you're going to grow from there so that's one thing i have observed recently um regarding my company hiring couple of people for a particular position and so guys um this vlogging is still i'm still getting used to it but i'm enjoying it just free my mind doing what i love doing it without thinking about it too much and i want you to always realize that realize that that whatever you do or whatever you're doing make sure that you don't over complicated things or you know about complicate things, you know about think things, do things freely. Be more of sim simplicity than over complicating things. And that's one thing I hate the most about sometimes when people are trying to do stuff or when people are trying to teach people stuff, they over complicate things. And it's like, for what purpose? We're supposed to make life easier for ourselves. Why make life more difficult? And that's what I want you to apply to your life if you're listening to this uh, vlog. Make sure that you don't have complicated things. Believe in yourself. Do your best. Always consistently working on growing. It's very important. Um, always learn to unlearn and learn new stuff again. It's very important. But only learn stuff that change your life positively, not change your life negatively. Because we have to be specific about that. If we're talking about Oh, you have to learn and unlearn and learn new things. What are you learning? Is it negative stuff? Are you unlearning positive stuff to learn negative stuff? So, we got to be very specific. Always focus on the positive side of life. It's difficult everywhere. What you do now, impact your future, impact your tomorrow. So, it's very important that you focus on doing the right thing for yourself. Um, how do you know if you're doing the right thing? You can tell. Your spirit can tell you if you're doing the right thing. Or your spirit can tell you if you're doing the bad thing or the wrong thing you know so guys this is a shot vlog